Hello friends, oh, what's up? I'm just putting on my socks. It is, what is today? Today is Tuesday. For some reason, I thought it was Wednesday. I'm always either a day behind or a day ahead. It's kind of ridiculous. It's about 12 o'clock. I've been up for a little bit. Um, I just cleaned a little bit. I replied to some emails. I edited some videos and I think I'm gonna continue like starting the vlog after I've been up a little bit because I'm uh, I'm dead in the morning. I have like no energy and it's just not, it's not fun to watch, you know? Stay hydrated, my friends. The goal for today, since I didn't do it yesterday, is to drink that entire gallon of water. And I think what I'll do is, because it is going to be like a daily thing, I'll constantly, like before ending or shutting off the vlog daily, I'll like show you guys how much I drank. And then maybe that'll motivate you guys to drink some more water too, because honestly, like drinking lots of water is super important. It's so important for your skin, for your body. It's like good for everything. And I just haven't, I don't even remember like the last time I've drank a lot of water. It's um, yeah, it's almost 12 o'clock. I have to go pick those there up. If you followed me on Instagram, and I think I told you guys on my vlog, I don't think I was vlogging at that time, but I got an industrial piercing done. I'll post the picture here. And I went to a place in Mississauga called Extremities. Uh, I'm just gonna say it because like they, effed it up. I called them once and then I went back to them once after getting it done telling them that everybody's saying like it was pierced incorrectly and they were just like no it's pierced correctly. So basically what they did was they angled the piercings at a wrong place. The industrial piercing is like a bar going straight through your ear and they put two different pier- it was just stupid. They put two different piercings and then when I posted it on Instagram everybody was like Laba they pierced it wrong. So I freaked out because I it was painful, number one. Like that piercing was not an easy piercing to get. It was two piercings at once and it was just, it was at the top here. So it's like the thickest part of your cartilage. And it, yeah, it was painful. So I was like, what the fuck? So I went to a few different other places and I showed them and three other places down here in Toronto, like tattoo piercing places were like, yeah, you have to take these out. So I took it out after three days. Three days I took them out two months ago and they said I could come back after six weeks and then they'll look at my ear to see if it healed enough. So that's what I'm going to go and show them. That was a long explanation. I could have just been like, I'm going to go get another industrial piercing. But So we're going to see what they say. If they say I can get it pierced, I may just get it pierced now. It's like 11.45 a.m. in the morning and I'm going to go get a piercing. But like, whatever. Ozara's going to come with me and if I... Whatever, I might just do it. I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. I got the freaking tripod finally for my car. So that will make my drives a lot more fun. Especially like when I'm driving like back home to Mississauga and stuff. I can talk to you guys. Uzair just went in to get some iced coffee. I surprisingly am not nervous for my piercing because I think it's like I didn't get give myself like time to think about it. Last time I got it done, I was like shitting bricks. I was so nervous. And like when I got the piercing, I like felt really lightheaded because I used all my energy up for like that initial piercing. I have to look at my ear to see if there's any like scar tissue and stuff. I really want it though. It looks really cool. And it's only like a three second pain, you know? It's only three seconds. That's the way I tell myself all the time. A lot of tattoo parlors and like, um, <clears throat> piercing places don't allow you to film I don't know why I know there was a reason but sometimes they don't allow you to film so I will ask them for sure I'll ask like the people I won't put them in it but like I'll see if I'm allowed to otherwise you'll probably just see my piercing at the end of it so we'll see what they say we've been like walking around a bunch of different places for no reason I'm so out of breath but we're still here I haven't got my piercing yet I'm about to go right now so let's see if the people say yes if I can film it I'm excited I'm nervous Look at the falls. Look at the fall time. Okay, so you guys are probably figuring out or trying to figure out why I haven't got my piercing yet. It's like, it's like four o'clock. So let me tell you what's going on. I went to a piercing place and she looked at my ear and she was like, honestly, I wouldn't even pierce your... So she kind of just rejected me. She's like, honestly, I'm, I wouldn't do it for you. So then I went to the guy that had taken out my industrial piercing. He was the one that told me just take it out and I'll do it when it's healed again. And so I went back to him and he saw it and he was like, honestly, I could offer you the service, but he, 
he also said he's like your ear is just not made for it like it doesn't make sense for you to pierce it so at least they were being honest and he was like it's just not going to heal properly and if i even if i do it you'll have to take it out eventually so now uh Uzair and i are going to go eat we're going to go to this restaurant called Taroni's, and he's raving about it for such a long time i'm telling you i think she's gonna like it yeah because every time I, he mentions it he like starts going crazy yeah and i feel like she doesn't like anything but she's gonna like this if yeah. anything just the appetizers then I feel like I won. Delicious. So we're gonna go there right now. And then after that, I may either get a nose piercing or like a different piercing. I'll, I don't know. We'll see. Let's, I just, we're just hungry. We haven't eaten anything. Let's go one anything. step at a time. One yeah, time. one step at a time. We're gonna get this. And we're gonna get, nope, uh, fungi. <laughs> this one. So this is mushrooms. Mushrooms. And then we also got a pizza that has mushrooms on it. And then we have more things coming. Yum. I just grab it with my hand. Yeah, and I don't dip it in anything. Nah. You're going to love this. Why would you eat the stem first? It tastes like meat. Oh, it doesn't like meat. Actually. All right. Six out of ten. All right, six out of ten. So we'll, we'll deal with six out of ten. The pizza is like really good. The pizza is good? The pizza is really good. It's like nice and fresh. Did you fold it? Yeah. Who do you think you are? Dan. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so this is some yummy cheese and then we got tomatoes and this and he's ready? Alright, let's do this. Ready? This is a like, 10. This is a like 10 out of 10. This is a 10 out of 10? Alright. Only Ella something. I forgot to only Ella something. This is the stuffed Ella This is the ravioli. No, this is the tortellini. No, this is. Why do we order so much food? Yeah. We're gonna go with our face Hello. I wanna. Okay, first we try the. This is gnocchi. Ready? I put chili flakes on it. Okay, I like that. I would rate that 7 out of 10. And this one is. Um, I actually don't remember this one. Stuffed with squash. Mm, that one's really good. Is it? And this one. Black? That one, yeah, that one I don't. This green one's really good. Alright, guys, Laba is getting her nose pierced. Um, they told us like we can just record the end bit, so we'll show you guys the actual piercing. I'm gonna tell you to take it. Yeah, exactly. Okay, so deep breath in. And out. Oh, shit. <laughs> Not like that. Just relax. Gonna be Ooh, I feel lightheaded. It's all good. You want a piece of candy after? You'll be okay. Yes. We got candy for you too. You're gonna tear up just a tiny bit because it is your nostril, you know? <clears throat> you're gonna keep that tissue there because you're bleeding a bit. Yeah. <laughs> Just do your breath, deep breath, deep breath. And close down the jewelry. Sure. And then I will. Oh, you're crying. It's just the. It's not even. It's just Hold from the. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. It's okay to cry. Um, it's just from. No, it's just from. Yeah. There's so many nerve endings in your nose. I've been trying to get my industrial pierced for like the longest, and everyone just says no. Why? So Why they're no? saying my ear isn't meant for it or something. Oh, oh your ear isn't meant for it. Like the way that it's built. Close this down a little bit more. Sure. I mean, I feel like. Is it 16 that would age or 18? 16. You do look very young. <laughs> That's good because he tells me I always look old. <laughs> oh, what a jerk! I just make That's fun of him. younger brother things. You know? Oh, okay. <laughs> So I was just telling Uzair, I really regret getting the hoop because I think the hoop is too big. Tell them about the experience. And yeah, I'm gonna tell them. It's too thick and I don't like the ball dangling, but oh my God, it hurt way more than I thought. I don't know why and I didn't think it was, I was gonna bleed because Thuba, like my best friend got it done and she, she didn't flinch, she didn't bleed, she was like good to go. But for me, it hurt so bad, like on a pain scale, it was like 11 out of 10. Whereas my cartilage, when I got my industrial, that was like a six out of 10. Like it was not bad. I'm gonna wait a few days and then I'm gonna see if I can go and uh, get it changed for a gold one because my piercings also don't heal with surgical steel. I have to put gold ones in. So I'll go find a nice gold one and then I'll take it in and then I'll just like ask her if she can switch it out for me and stuff like that. But I'm happy I got it done. I know my mom's gonna be super upset I did it. Okay, so I know you guys can't tell that easily, but I hate this hoop because it's so freaking big and bulky, you guys. Oh, 
I'm so frustrated right now because it's my mistake and I shouldn't have done the hoop But I'm headed to the mall right now I FaceTimed Manal and Manal saw it and she was like whoa that's like it's like so big and bulky It does I really like I want it and I know I should wait to get it changed But like I can't so I'm gonna go to the mall right now I'm gonna see if I can find a small dainty gold hoop. I will get that. Otherwise, I'm switching it out for a stud. I'll show you guys the process of doing it. If it hurts too much, I won't, but like I need this changed ASAP. I just, I'm such an idiot. I'm like so impulsive. Yeah, oh, support. All right, guys, <laughs> I'm here. I'm at the, um, there's a store here near my place, and Nicole's here. She's actually a subscriber, so she's helping me. She told me how to do it, and I'm gonna take this out. And I've got like a little cute little tiny stud that I'm gonna put in instead. So let's see if like I don't know if you guys can see me do this, but like But look, I got this really tiny tiny, you can like barely see it. Do you see how tiny it is? And I'm gonna put this one instead. Okay. Yay, I did it! Yay! That's so much better. And is there like a do I lock it in place? Nope. That's it? Yeah. It's just stays in. Just be careful when you're doing like your morning routine and stuff yeah. like that. You don't want it to get put towels and mm -hmm. stuff like that. It'll get caught on the towel and okay. it will come out. So it literally just it go around it like this and everything. Go around oh, with the cute. Yeah, hey, you guys, I did it. Look how much better that looks. So much better. Okay. I feel so much better with the stud. Um, it was like the smallest one they had and like it's it's perfect. Like honestly, she even said, she was, oh my gosh, sweetest girl ever. And I changed it in the mall because I just felt more comfortable with her there. Like she was so, she was so nice. And she didn't even tell me she was a subscriber until I was putting my camera down and I was like, oh yeah, like I just, I vlog and stuff. And she was like, girl, I watch your videos. And I was like, oh my God, you should have told me before. She was so helpful and she was so nice. I changed it in the store. I also got an extra hoop in case I want to change it to a hoop later. But I I think I'm gonna keep it to a stud because I feel like it just may be less um, movement instead you know what I'm saying so yay I'm really really happy I had so much anxiety because I thought that it would hurt and basically what I found out that is that she the person who pierced it pierced it with a 16 gauge and apparently 16 gauges are like too thick it was very thick like it was like double the thickness of this piercing here and she's like that's normally what they use for like eyebrow piercings and stuff it's not cute on the nose so I I put in a thinner one and cuz it's literally just an uh, hour fresh piercing it's gonna the hole will close to make it very nice and small and fine instead of it being like a big thick hole so now it is eight o'clock I'm gonna go grab some gas put it in my car cuz tomorrow morning I have to wake up early I have to go back to Mississauga to my mom's place I have to take her to an appointment I also have a laser um, laser appointment tomorrow too so I'm gonna do that and then I will talk to you guys when I'm home guys so I only drank this much water today I would say I drank a little bit more I want to say I drank like about here because I did have a one water bottle like while we were out and about but come on like I'm being like this is I'm failing I can't be failing the goal is before I sleep to at least get it down like up till here I have to edit a video so I'm about to go do that on my computer right now I have to put up a vlog um, what I did find out is that the pain level the reason why it hurt so much was because they pierced it with a thicker gauge than they should have like nose piercings I guess it doesn't matter but like nose piercings should not be pierced with that thick of a, a, a thing you know what I'm saying so that's why it hurts so much otherwise it shouldn't have I'm just gonna quickly edit a vlog that has to go up for tomorrow so then I'll update you guys when I'm done doing that it's like 11 o'clock right now I just got finished editing two vlogs that go up on my um, on this channel of course I'm gonna take my ass to sleep I have to wake up at 8 a.m. tomorrow morning to get home in time to go to a bunch of appointments so I will see you guys tomorrow bye